calling this a healthy chimichanga because it's not completely deep fried, but it does have a little oil. This recipe is so cheap to make, it's healthy and it's full of flavor. It has the proteins, the carbs. So the first thing that we're gonna start doing is making the sauce. I have some peppers. I chose the sweet ones to make the sauce, you know, like not too overpowered by a green one. I don't know, I just like the sweet ones. As you can see, I only ended up using one onion because one was rotten. Ugh, that looks so gross. So don't worry too much about the size you cut your veggies as long as everything is the same. So as you can see, like at my peppers and my onions are relatively the same size. I'm also chopping up some cauliflower to give it some creaminess. It's really gonna help me make this sauce really creamy. So I have everything on a sheet tray. I added some salt, some paprika, some pepper, and again, I'll have the whole recipe in the description below. I also added some chili powder and just a little bit of cube. I also added some garlic powder and I mixed everything up and I put it into the oven and it's gonna stay in there for 30 minutes on 375 or so. Meanwhile, I'm going to make my rice, and I'm just using some organic brown rice. And while the rice cooks, we're going to start working on our feta mix. So I added a little water to a hot pan, my onions, and some green peppers. I also added some salt and pepper, and I cooked it for about 5 minutes, and then I set it aside. I added my veggies to a blender and I added about a half cup of water and to that I added the juice of one small little lemon. I also added a big chunk of cilantro and I blended everything for quite a bit, I want to say like two or three minutes. So this is what the sauce should look like and this sauce is so good. When the rice is done cooking, mix some more sauce on that to make it taste even better and just mix it around until the sauce is all incorporated in there. And, and now we're going to start assembling. So we're going to put some sauce on our tortillas. You can use whatever tortillas you want, but I'm using whole wheat organic tortillas that I got from Whole Foods. So I'm adding my rice and some black beans. I also have my fajita mix on top and this is how you fold them. Tuck the sides in and then fold everything over and tuck in again with your fingers. To a hot pan I'm going to add a tablespoon of oil and I'm just going to melt that all over the surface before adding my little chimichangas and you want to put them face down. Make sure you keep an eye on these because they're only going to cook for about 30 seconds to a minute on each side. So don't walk away. As soon as you place them all down, you'll probably have to start flipping. The cool thing about these little chimichanga pockets is that you can put whatever you want in them. So if you don't like whatever I'm putting in them, just do what, whatever vegetables, tofu, corn, spinach, anything you want. So that's it for this video. These chimichangas honestly turned out so good. I hope that you guys give them a try and give me a thumbs up if you like this video and please don't forget to subscribe to my very very tiny channel.